and to your credit, you guys fought. The guys that came off the bench, um, Dan and Scotty and uh, Mark and Marcus, you guys that gave us those minutes in the first half allowed guys like Jamal and Keith and Malik and Andre to play those minutes later in the game, okay? That's what it's, it's going to take. With Keith and Jamal, and you add Malik into that mix against a team like St. Francis, New York, I mean, you have three kids that can make plays. And it's so hard to, to run set plays now. And you have to be able to execute some stuff, but everybody scouts everybody, and everybody knows everybody's offense and everybody's tendencies. And at some point, the player's got to make the plays. And to have Jamal and Keith, uh, you know, there's sometimes in the game where I feel like I'm not engaged because they know what to, they know what to call and what to run. And, um, you know, they certainly have the freedom and over their, their careers here have demonstrated that they, they know what to do. And, and I know the teammates trust them, our staff trusts them, and uh, it makes the game a lot easier uh, when you have two kids like that that can, that can make plays, especially against a team like St. Francis, New York. I mean, it's humbling, you know, just to hear the words from the coach himself. But, you know, it's just um, a note to the hard work that I put in, you know, just being able to do whatever I can to help the team get better. Because this offseason, I really wanted to focus on my weaknesses. And I really think that I did a good job in the uh, offseason. And uh, it's paying off now. And uh, hopefully I can keep helping my team uh, in the future. Uh, defense, uh, shooting, uh, just boxing out on rebounds because you know, a couple people just out jump me sometimes. So if I get position, I could get better numbers. But uh, jump shot was definitely a big point for me because, you know, just me being a driver mostly uh, most of my life, I had to get the three point shot in definitely in college. So uh, I worked hard on that in the summer and uh, it's really paying off. It's down to five. King now drives left hand oh. and scores. I just being a little bit more aggressive and, and letting the game come to me. Um, some nights I won't score 20. Like, uh, you know, some night might be Andre Knight where he hit 12 threes or eight threes. Who knows with him or Keith get high or Scott. You know, even Scott can come out and give us eight threes. Um, hopefully we get Randall back soon. He's going to start. he give us double digits. It's not me going to the game looking to score. It's just looking for me to be aggressive and get what the defense takes. And, and lately, they've been giving me lanes and, and jumpers to where I have to knock down shots and, and get open looks. Andre drives. Can't get oh. it to go. It's tipped up and in by Flag. Put it on the rim, and then Flag cleaned it up. Huge. Huge. And, uh, you know, the young man, um, you know, certainly our prayers are with his family. They're, uh, you know, they lost a loved one. And to see him come out and perform – under those circumstances, I'd, I'd argue that it's his best game of his of his freshman year. You know, in a tough, I mean, we put him in at the end of the game. You know, when the game's on the line, and he performed. And uh, you know, to, to see him come out under those circumstances, you know, to to, to have 11 points and uh, six rebounds in 13 minutes, that was a big, big step for us, and, and a big part of us winning the basketball game.